Alright, let's continue with Ven. I've been looking towards playing this game for a while now and since the quest kind of release is scheduled still for the second quarter of this year so I basically want to have a whole playthrough before the port is gonna happen for us so I think I remember when I left off and let's continue from there. Now I'm playing on virtual desktop, so that's kind of like a different situation because I tried out this game on Link. Power attack. Yeah, I know. Because the camera in the game is kind of like unique by itself, they could like update a patch that you could just move it manually because it moves like automatically when you steer van and stuff. But knowing that this game eventually will come to quest and now I'm playing like on virtual desktop without the cable, it just like feels natural because sometimes you have to move your head in certain directions to like see other things like on the sides. But I'm not restricted by cable because... Oh shit. <laughs> so it just feels more natural and I definitely will be happy when this game like comes out officially on Quest because... It is something that we don't have at all as a genre itself, so looking forward to it definitely. I don't know how I feel about this chest still because much like in a Crash Bandicoot style, when you're destroying the chests you're kinda like doing a progression system in a way that something maybe unlocks in the future if you like complete level 100%. I still have no idea if I will actually do a 100% run. I only noticed that while collecting those little vents, you unlock the levels further on, so you have to find them in order to like progress the game properly, I'm assuming. That's what it was explained to me. But chests maybe are like, you know, oh, <laughs> like an extra thing, and they still are easily missable, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna be like 100% really this game, so we'll see. Right now I just wanna focus on the gameplay, I guess. It looks gorgeous though, like holy hell. I'm still like amazed by the... Just graphics in general, especially for platformers like that. I mean, it kinda makes sense because you're not moving like awfully a lot, so... Having like graphics more than just basic stuff is very neat like it's just eye candy at this point we're at the temple i didn't even notice oh but we are going down the top okay <laughs> what the yeah, okay. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> I think that might be the end of the level, actually. <laughs> I guess he went from the other side. Oh, What are you doing here? Oh, shit, not the red one. They're annoying. I think having manual camera will benefit this game immensely, especially if it's gonna release some quest. That's my personal opinion because I like having a choice, I guess. Oh, nope. And especially that if you wanna search for those crates to destroy, moving head like constantly it's not like very much fun especially when you're sitting so it would just be nice to have a different option <laughs> shit 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 oopsie <laughs> surprisingly sometimes chest saves when you're dying so i'm still a little bit confused how the saving system works especially I 
I might have actually 100% by accident, pretty much. But this is a big area. Oh my god. <laughs> Congrats. Level 1 complete. From now on, the challenges you face will get only greater. The world outside the village is one in which Nelson's forces have left a visible mark. Be careful and watch your step. Okay. Give me a minute. I want to grab chests. Some people say this game is like hard. It gets hard, so I'm actually interested. I think I have 100%. I'm not completely sure, but I think. Oh. <laughs> I missed one van. What? And I missed two chests somehow. I don't know, I still don't know how it exactly works. And honestly, I'm not sure if I should like really 100% this game, but like these are just small details, I feel like. I'm not sure there will be like a true ending to something here. It has like a time attack thing as well, so it has like a repeat system, but I'll just focus on the storyline, honestly. What hope it is. <laughs> Once the main transshipment port of Aspirus. Nelson left his robots there, ordering them to collect anything that could be of use later. Keep your eyes open and remember that Ikai's could be hiding anywhere. Yeah. Yeah, well, bye. In Crash, there was a thing that when you collect all the things from the stages, you have secret things. But I'm not completely sure that Van will have the same system. So I'm just playing safe for now. <laughs> there are some games that is like, you know, meaningful to 100% because you get, for example, like true endings or just hidden stuff. I'm pretty sure in Van is just satisfaction but I don't think something extra I might be wrong of course that wouldn't surprise me <laughs> especially that you don't really have an option to go back to that part you want to repeat you have to repeat the whole level I think that would not make sense in the play for standpoint If you couldn't go back to something, then it would not be available to block the way, I guess? From just the game development standpoint. Oh, there's a fan. Fishing! <laughs> Okay. Tentacles. Shit, 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 shit. Come here. I'm still gonna try to do 100% but it's not my focus unlike in other games Double kill out <laughs> oh no skills Oh, 
I wonder if we're gonna get some more complex mechanics, like combos maybe, to some attacks. That would be nice. That oh, definitely. <laughs> This poison, sometimes <laughs> they are tricky to dodge. How do I go there? Oh, okay, I see. Okay, got it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what are you doing here? Chilling? I'm gonna get you. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, she almost killed me, okay. I thought this raft was real. They're surprisingly easy to find for now. I mean, I missed one in the previous stage, but I have no idea when or where. Hmm. Okay, I see. Come here. <laughs> Why am I going there exactly though? Yeah, I don't know where. Ow! Oh. I didn't notice there's a hole there. Here we go. Okay, that should be dead, I think. For now I didn't see like really challenging stuff, maybe regions, because we have three, each are gonna have like a boss fight at the end, I kinda would wish. Great job, my scanner has detected Nilsen's ship, we're on our way there, nobody knows what this madman has left behind to slow us down. For now I'm just dying from my mistakes and that's it. <laughs> See, I missed one A key again. I don't even know how. So I'm assuming a few chests as well. Yeah, two chests as well. <laughs> so maybe I'm gonna call it 90% of playthrough. <laughs>